the elite collars and leads. It is Raging Elsa. Can it break through at start number 16, set to run. And racing, missing the start there was Catch a Cod. And Raging Elsa, third at the break, is going for an inside run. Gee, it's going to get tight around the outside. Half Mac now has taken the lead. So Half Mac clear over Bernadette, then Raging Elsa, third. Aston Image and out wide, being followed then by Get On Gizmo. Further back on the field, then snowed in a minute back with Bluey's Das and Catch a Cod back towards the end. It's Half Mac. Oh, Raging Elsa can't get there. Half Mac beats an unlucky Raging Elsa and snowed in third, followed by Bernadette and then Catch a Cod. And further back, Get On Gizmo. Bluey's Dash and Aston Imogen, 22.90. And the run there for the uh, favourite, Raging Elsa. It went into the race as a 15-start maiden, remains a maiden, and has been beaten by half Mac. Four beats, two, seven and eight, 22.902. Well, half Mac, you could see that um, in the early stages, Raging Elsa didn't have the pace to hold the front. You could just see the, the pressure and momentum from out wide. It was always going to get a little bit squeezed up. It sort of survived that okay. And then when it needed to finish the race off, I'm not sure if it knew whether it was going inside or outside of the eventual winner and probably 